In this week's module, we will be turning our focus to Microsoft PowerPoint 2010. A PowerPoint presentation, which is also called a slideshow, can help you deliver a dynamic, professional-looking message to an audience. The process of developing a presentation that communicates specific information requires careful analysis and planning. As a starting point, establish why the presentation is needed. Next, analyze the intended audience for presentation and unique needs. Then, gather information about the topic and decide what to include in the presentation. Finally, determine the presentation design and style that will be most successful at delivering the message. Before you begin working with PowerPoint, we need to familiarize ourselves with the PowerPoint screen. We first want to start here with the slide outline pane. It displays slides and outlines. Next is the slide pane. It displays reduced size slides. The slide that you are currently viewing is the title slide. The title slide contains placeholders. The top placeholder is where you would type the title of your presentation. The second placeholder is for the subtitle, such as your name and your date and the location where you are presenting your presentation. Many of the tools you will be using can be found under the various tabs located at the top of the screen. You can access these tools by clicking on the tab name. Take a few minutes to familiarize yourself with where these tools are located by viewing each of the tabs. Notice each group on the ribbon as you click the tabs. Please keep in mind that many of the tools that you used in Microsoft Word can also be used the same way in PowerPoint. In order to assist you in using PowerPoint, I have uploaded a series of video tutorials located in the video vault of this module. You may also complete the tutorials found in PowerPoint Chapter 1 and PowerPoint Chapter 2. If you should have any questions, please post them to the help links provided. Thank you for watching and have a great day.